I genuinely find myself right now feeling quite sorry for Jackson Carlow. Yeah. No, I, I've been a politician for 30 years and I still can't imagine getting so bound up in bitter partisan politics that I can't bring myself to welcome the fact that we have made such progress against a deadly virus. How blinded must you be to find yourself in that position? And my tolerance for this kind of politics is lower than it has ever been before. Um, let me just, the, the figure, the, the, the conclusion I drew about the relative uh, prevalence was not wrong. The, the figures I accept, the figures I accept were not published, and that is not down to me, it's down to decisions of the UK government. But again, I come back to, we're in a position right now that over the course of July, we have had nine registered deaths under the daily measurement in Scotland, none for the last two weeks at all. And the corresponding figure in England is around 2,000. So even if you think the figure I used previously was wrong, you're entitled to think that. The figures now demonstrate, demonstrate the relative position. And why would anybody try to gain say that? Why would anybody find pleasure in arguing that that is not the case? I've had to stand up day in and day out and report these death figures. Uh, the relief I feel every day when I'm able to report uh, no deaths because of the reducing prevalence, because of the reducing incidence, because people across this country are doing the right things is immense. And I'm going to continue to focus on that. Yes, I will continue to do everything to persuade people to wear face coverings. And in terms of my party, every penny of profit made will go to charity, uh, actually. Yeah. Um, but I will do everything possible to encourage people to abide by all of the advice because that's what's got us into this position. Jackson Carlaw, for his own narrow reasons, might not want to recognise the strong position Scotland has got itself into, but I'm afraid it is a reality. And the focus now and the challenge for all of us is to make sure we continue that reality and don't go backwards. And that's what I'm going to continue to spend every waking moment of my life concentrating on.